students now we will read the next paragraph glimpsing uh, glimpsing a peak in in the distance i get transported to the another world i experience a change within myself whenever uh, aluvalia has glimpsed or noticed uh, the peak from the from distance from the, uh, from uh, at a uh, at a specific uh, uh, distance through a specific distance he get transported to the another world how he had transported he experienced a change within myself within myself means he has changed uh, uh, he had experienced a change in uh, in his uh, inner self how because which can only be called mystical it means he had a change he had seen a change in his beliefs he had uh, you know uh, increased her religious beliefs he has enriched her religious beliefs these mountains have helped him to know himself understood here uh, these mountains have told him to evaluate yourself and these mountains have also show the path to uh, to be a to be change your meaning it means it is showing the detachment from the world like by its beauty by the beauty of it means the avarice by the beauty of avarice uh, and aloofness aloofness means remoteness might it means their size and ruggedness means endurance so and the difficulties encountered it means experience on the way the difficulties he has experienced on the way the peak draws me to it it means the peak has taken me to it it has taught me how to fight with this kind of difficulties understood so i have now thought about where because i as i have learned from this though i have learned from is i have learned uh, that uh, 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 that my uh, i have been separated i have detached from this world how he had detached uh, how the mountains have detached uh, the Al aluvalia from the world that because he had uh, he had uh, enhanced his uh, uh, beliefs his beliefs have become more strong his religious beliefs have become has become more strong now understood he had now he knew the uh, meaning of the uh, uh, word life what is life is why we had come on the earth what is the real meaning of living on the earth so now he is not more, no more materialistic now he is thinking about beyond the material material as the person are include in the materialistic thing but now he had understood beyond the materials now he had created these mountains have made that person totally changed he became more uh, strong more uh, you can say more stronger more uh, intelligent and you can say and uh, even he had a strong and firm belief it has created a strong and firm belief in so uh, uh, the peak rose me to it everest did so no, nothing has done it but everest has taught him no other thing has taught him in this world but everest has taught him everything it is a challenge that it is difficult to resist you can't combat it with it resist means to you can't combat with it the challenges it is a challenge that is difficult to resist means you can you can combat it you can combat the challenges looking back i find that i have not yet fully explained why i climbed everest whenever we uh, uh, whenever i uh, move down to my memories i always uh, i have a one question mark that why i have climbed the um, uh, everest it is like answering a question why you breathe so he is comparing that answering uh, if you want to ask some person why you have climbed the everest then the person will ask why do you uh, why do you uh, breathe or why do you help your neighbor or why do you want to go do good acts so all these questions arose your mind there is no final answer possible you can't answer it understood though the questions arose in your mind but you can't answer it and then there is uh, there is the fact that everest is not just a physical climb the man who has been to the mountain top becomes conscious in a special manner of his own smallness in this large universe it means the uh the, here the writer wants to explain that whenever uh, it, it is the fact that after it is just not a, it is not just a physical climb it is it makes you a mental stronger it makes you from inner it makes you stronger from your inner the man who has been to the mountain top be becomes conscious in a special manner of his own smallness in this large universe then we come to know oh we are nothing in this universe we are a a point in this universe we are an atom in this universe understood uh, so it realizes us where we stand these mountains have uh, told us that see 
uh, you uh, as we think ourselves as the mightiest in the in this world as we show our strength in this world but we are not that thing understood these uh, mountains have taught us that how much we are uh, we are an atom in this world understood a very smallest part of this world this universe understood